bigger. He's better. Ladies and gentlemen, it's too much for the rivals in ether. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's finally ready. Greetings. It is I, Hemoth, master of evil and part-time workshop dev. Perhaps you've heard of me. If not, you've likely heard of my new team, the Villains of Ether. I am here to proudly announce the release and breakdown of Pete, the two-tongued terrestrial terror, and rival to that no-good gold-hearted narwhal Wally. While many other characters have very complex and intricate gimmicks, Pete does not. He was made with a simple goal in mind. While many base cast fighters and rivals, and many other workshop creations, pay homage to various fighting games, Pete is no exception. The goal behind Pete was to create the ultimate homage to many giants and grapplers from various fighting games. Allow me to elaborate. Beginning with the jab. You may recognize it having similarities with Broly, and the elbow that follows it being very similar to that of Hugo. Speaking of Hugo, you will notice that Pete takes the signature projectile destroying clap and applies it here as well, unlike K. Rules. You can also see homages to Hugo and K. Rool respectively, with back air and up air. Back air is Hugo's signature butt lunge. Be careful. Once you throw it out, you will have to stay committed. So don't go throwing it around aimlessly and let those heroes take your victory. Up air is a fast headbutt inspired by King K. Rool. It stalls you in the air for a brief period of time, but mostly covers vertical spaces. Use it to poke opponents on platforms and then fast fall to take the initiative. Down tilt takes inspiration from E. Honda and can similarly be pressed repeatedly mm, for continuous damage. Up tilt is inspired by the Hulk. Strike fast when they least expect it. Recognize that collab? Down air also pays homage to the Hulk in a similar fashion. This clap is powerful enough to dunk on even the strongest of enemies. Don't you know who I am? With Dash Attack taken from Juggernaut, you too can feel unstoppable. Not to mention Down Strong and Up Strong, also inspired by Juggernaut. It's showtime! With Ford Strong inspired by Bowser's signature punch, from Bowser's Inside Story. Now, when developing Pete, we knew that our beloved big boy would likely suffer the cruel fate of being absolute combo fodder. So, I decided to give him one of the best forward airs and neutral airs in platform fighting history. Bowser's and Wario's. Neutral Air is a two-hit combo starter, based on Wario's Smash 4 Neutral Air. Use it correctly, and you can get really nasty with this kind of move, as you can imagine. Same goes for Forward Air. This move itself has enough power to take down anyone who stands between Pete and his lunch. Now on to the specials. Neutral Special has multiple uses both on the ground and the air. When used on the ground, it's a powerful earthquake, very similar to the Hulk, which can drag your opponent to the edge. However, in the air, it becomes a powerful dive inspired by Mole Knight. Quick and killing. Oh, and believe me, its utility cannot be understated. This will be the go-to move for your mobility, and will be what separates the Pete Proletariat from the Pete Professionals. Moving on. Ah, F Special. Your bread and butter. The classic command grab. Based on Bowser's, 
This devastating slam is sure not only to cripple your opponent's bones, but your opponent's mental fortitude as well. Be sure to use it often. Hey, you ever wondered what Bowser's down special would be if it was safe on land? Well, now you don't have to anymore. Use this move in the air to get to the ground fast. Use it on the ground to bypass projectiles and get in close to your opponents. Ah, yes, another grappler classic. The anti-air grab. Up special, specifically inspired by Android 16's Make sure to space this move correctly, or you'll be catching nothing but air. Just like every other movement option you have available, Taunt also shakes the screen. Be sure to intimidate your enemies with your unrivaled girth. And here's a little secret. Hold down to dance on their graves. With all the properties, proportions, and playstyles of various heavy grapplers and characters from fighting games, Pete the Mole is your kind of guy. With inspirations from Android 16, Hulk, Juggernaut, Hugo, Bowser, Wario, King K. Roo, and E. Honda, this beast can bounce back the damage it receives from any hero who dares step into his ring. Pete will be digging into Rival's workshop immediately after this presentation. Pete's stage and theme song is currently in development and will be released in the near future along with the stage. I also want to give a special thanks to all the other villainous devs who helped to make Pete a reality. Thanks to Pajoda and Dark Dakarai for helping the programming behind Pete, and thanks to Nitro Anilin for the music that slaps harder than a third degree burn. Lastly, I want to thank all the other Villains of Ether members. All the critique and playtesting was invaluable for Pete's creation, and I deeply appreciate that. It is my sincerest hope that you've enjoyed our characters and presentations thus far, and I am personally excited to announce more down the road. But that is a presentation for another day, and I wouldn't want to spoil the surprise. Until then, enjoy.